well, my journey began really wanting to be a journalist. I really loved writing. I really loved learning about English novels. But then my mom really inspired me. She was a teacher, principal, superintendent. Um, and so I segued from journalism into um, education. Being my mother's daughter has been a phenomenal, phenomenal experience. I owe my mother everything. She told me to always, and I saw her always, put the children first. Even you know when she was superintendent, there was never an issue that was too far beyond, well, what do the parents say? What do the families need? What do the families want? This is their school, this is their community. We're serving them. I'm looking forward to welcoming our parents back on school grounds, welcoming our students back on school grounds fully. The greatest opportunity that our children have by being on site is their neighbor, is the child that's sitting next to them or across the lunch table from them during that time, the child that's out on the playground with them. Because learning is taking place in the hallways, on, in the cafeteria, on the playground, as much as it is in the classroom. And that's essential for our children. Well, I find inspiration, you know, with the children and with the teachers and I just have to keep them supported, motivated, encouraged, um, informed, um, and safe. And I find my ministry here at Greenwood Elementary School is not a job. Um, it is a profession, but it's my ministry.